Welcome back. This Excel tutorial will show you how to remove duplicates from your data. So this is a simple tutorial. Uh, it's probably more advanced ways of doing this uh, and there's a lot more to it, but this is going to be a simple introduction. Uh, it should give you enough information to be able to continue and do what you need to do. So we'll get straight into it. You can see we've got two tables here. We want to remove duplicates. Um, you know, you could have uh, a list of people with their names, email addresses and uh, phone numbers for example and obviously if you're using like a mailing list you don't want to be sending it to the same person twice whatever you're using to mail should pick up on that but if you just want to make sure that your uh, list and data is correct and without duplicates you need to use this tool you could do it manually obviously but uh, when you're working with uh, large amounts of data it's obviously good to be able to do it uh, much simpler so we're going to use the, the remove duplicates uh, tool today it's in the data tab uh, at the top here click data and then it's uh, here so we want to first of all select our entire range of data you can see in this example we've got uh, two name fives and fives so this is probably the common example this uh, you'd have to select all your data including the headers um, well it's up to you but we'll see in a minute if we click on remove duplicates you can see we've got the option if we've included the headers in our selection we need to make sure we tick this uh, and the columns you can see we can check both um, and it will remove duplicates from all of that so if we click OK you can see it's removed one duplicate and nine unique values remain so it's removed the name five and the five which was obviously the same if we were to choose something like this if we gave name five uh, ten we were to select it click remove duplicates click it it wouldn't find any because it's selecting um, both of the columns to check for if you get what I mean. So it's looking at name 5 and 5 um, and there's obviously just one with name 5 and 5. If we wanted to see if people had the same name, I mean why would you? Because some people may do. Um, but you can uh, choose a column here. This will let you only select one to actually look for data. So if we uncheck number you can see all the numbers are fine, it's just the names. So if we click that, it will remove one of the duplicates. It will remove this person with name 5. So maybe you have somebody with an ID, and obviously only one person needs the ID, so you could remove the duplicate. Uh, it could be a common example if somebody's filled out a form and your data is going into Excel, um, they might have filled it out twice with the same data. So you can check with that. Um, but obviously you can see how it might be helpful. So that's it. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have, remember to leave a like. And if you're new, uh, subscribe. It really helps out. And I will see you in another video. Thanks for watching.